Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be cooking a flank steak. The steak came out really moist and tender. So here is my steak. I have washed it and dried it. And next thing I'm going to do is season it well with some salt, black pepper, and seasoned salt. I have it seasoned and already in the pan. And I'm gonna bake this for about two and a half hours. I already have my oven on 350 degrees. So I'm just going to put a lid on it and I'm gonna put it in the oven and let it bake. So here's my lid for the pan. If you want, if you would like to use a different type of dish or pan to bake it in, you can just make sure you cover it. And also I added about one cup of water to it. I could have seared it off but I decided to bake it. So here it is baking after maybe an hour and a half. So I checked it and I put my cover back on it, the little aluminum lid, and I put it back in the oven for about another hour. So here it is again. And the reason why I was checking it because I didn't want it to overcook. Some people like this steaks cooked medium. Some like this rare, but I like mine well done. So I let it cook longer. And here it is. I have taken it out of the oven and it has cooked well done. So the last thing I'm gonna do is add some barbecue sauce to it. I'm gonna cover the top and I'm gonna drain a little bit of the water off. You can if you like, if you don't, you don't have to. And I'm gonna put this back in the oven for about 20 minutes uncovered and let it cook. And the steak came out really, really good. And right here, I'm just cooking some collard greens. I do have some collard green videos on the channel. If you would like to make some collard greens. And these came out very tasty. And I made some yams there in another video. If you want to add some yams to it or whatever side dish you want to use. So here is my steak, guys. Really moist and tender. So if you like flank steak, you can try this recipe. It's simple and easy. And don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, guys. And I hope to see you in the next video.